Hello everybody, Joe here. So talk about minimalism, my health, I try to be raw and real and honest. And today is the second part to the January Declutter Challenge, which is a pick a number declutter challenge hosted by Melinda for Melinda Clean and Simple. And so we are just gonna pick through my closet because I've seen some items that I want to declutter from it. And I might pick through some other spots around my room and see if I can find anything else. And then we'll be, and then at the end of this video, I will attach a picture of stuff that I've already decluttered. Well, it's in the, you know, the declutter pile that's still, that's gonna go after this challenge is done. But, so that stuff's already, that those items have already been figured out and are gonna go to somebody. So I just, so I'll post it, I'll, I'll attach the picture at the end so you can see that. So with that picture, there's, there's eight items in that picture. So our count is gonna start from there. And the day I'm filming this is the 25th. And I think I put out my, um, First declutter video on the 18th for the first half of the month. So the, so the items I'm decluttering now over the last half of the month. And so, yay. Um, so, as you can see from my closet, my clothes and stuff were washed today. So there is nothing in my laundry hamper. It is empty. So all my clothes, pajamas, lounge clothes, they're all hanging up. Undergarments and stocks are still in those two um, st packing cubes. And that means all these hangers right here are extra. I do have two p pairs of shorts in the bottom of my closet that are for summer. So. With these extra hangers, um, open our last place and the place we, we've been living in now, and the place before that, we never used all these extra hangers. Even if we had company visiting um, uh, this place because we don't use the coat closet as a coat closet, we use it as the cat's litter box. Um, people aren't hanging up their coats in a coat closet, they're just kind of laying them down or wearing them. So we need to keep all these extra hangers. Because I don't use them. My roommate doesn't use them. So we're going to get rid of, I'd say, most of them. And only keep a few. Because I do like to keep a few extra hangers on hand. So let's see here. In the closet, we have these four... Well, one's plastic, and these three, like this. Well, this one's like rubbery plastic, it's like hard plastic. The, these, this hanger, and then these three. Um, I'm not a, I'm not a fan of light wood, and my roommate isn't either, so these two can go. So, um, I received these two stickers for free recently because I got a new pair of shoes. So now I own two pairs of shoes instead of one. And so these stickers can go. But these two hangers will keep. And then I'm going to keep one, two, three, four, 
five extra belt hangers because I think that's plenty. And then we're going to get rid of one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. So, so far we're getting rid of 16 hangers and two stickers. So that's 18. These three pant hangers, I'm gonna keep because I do put my shorts on these in the summer. So two of these hangers will be taken up when it's hot out with the shorts on them. So, so, the, so these three hangers will stay. And then, yeah, so besides getting a second pair of shoes, the other thing I got was I got these grippy socks for, was it Christmas or my birthday? Anyway, last year, and they need to be washed, but I will, I will, I will definitely wear these. I... I love grippy socks. They are great. Um, if you if you have, if you have chronic health issues, you know. So, and then the other thing I wanted to clutter is this coat. I'm probably gonna because. I've had it for a few years and it's really warm and cozy and everything, but it's just, I'm not loving how it fits on me. And even when I was skinnier, I wasn't loving it. And then today when I was going to go wash it, it, um, I realized that I've been washing in a washing machine this whole time and it's dry clean. So, no wonder this jacket has felt weird when I pulled it out of the washer and dryer. Because it's not supposed to get washed that way. So, oops. So, it's going to get decluttered. And then... I actually prefer this hanger over this black plasticky one because this is a wood hanger. It's a, you know, they painted it black or something, but it's a wood hanger. So I'm actually going to get rid of this one. that's better that is much much better so can I show you the closet pulled out so you see that big gap that's where that big like sweater coat was so this is all my clothes. Can get moved. And that's how they are all scrunched together. These are, so I've got my robe, coats, sweater jacket, tops, my pair of pants, lounge top slash pajama tops, and lounge pants and pajama pants. So, and then this, these are all the extra hangers, although two of those technically aren't extra because I use those in the summer. So, that's fantastic. So, 
and I'll show you. But see, there's my new pair of shoes, there's my old pair of shoes, and then I have house slippers. So this video is already 10 minutes long. So I think I'm gonna, let's count up what we're decluttering. And then we'll um, end this video. So you got the one coat, so that's one. And then two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen hangers and two stickers. And then the box my new shoes came in is going to be going, but I don't feel like I can count that. I mean, yeah, it's going, but I don't try not to count like trash and recycling. So, and that box technically is. So 18, 18. So what did I say we were at? I just talked and lost count. So one. So 21 items plus the picture with the eight items I'm getting rid of. So that's 29 items. For the rest of the month. Oh my word, that is that is a lot. But the perfectionist in me wants to make it an even 30. So I'm going to see if I can find one more item. So let's see. This. No, no, no. It's all stuff I'm keeping. It's all stuff I'm keeping for now. Anything this other night stand for? Like stuff I need to deal with. Nope, just stuff I need to deal with. Okay. Well, let's make one quick sweep of other areas and see if we can't find item number 30. I doubt it, but I just want to take one quick look. Um, don't want to turn on. The bathroom is basically good. All my movies and games I'm keeping. Let's check. Let's check the kitchen real fast. See if there's anything in the kitchen I want to let go of. I mean, really, my roommate and I use everything in our kitchen, so I don't think I'm going to see anything. Yeah, no, I don't. This is all stuff that we use, all stuff that we love. So... I feel like you're reaching down there. Okay, so we're going to have a final count of the 29 items, which I think my count for the first video was 71. So we ended the month decluttering 100 items. Holy wow, just, just wow. So if you like this video, 
please go check out my other videos. I do Tiny Tidy Tuesday, which is a open collab hosted by Sunday Dawn from The Helpful Home. I do, on the first Friday of the month, I do 10 Minutes Better, which is a collab also hosted by Melinda from Melinda Plain It Simple. So make sure you check her out. And probably next week is when I will put out a video explaining my laundry routine. So thanks for watching. Loves. Bye.